listed through an unbelievable game and uh, kept us in the game the entire time. And even though they went up one nothing, I told her, I said, just keep us there. You know, if you could keep us at one run, you know, we'll do our best to score two and get us a win. And I thought defensively we played really well. And then we finally started to put better swings on Cesaro later in the game. You know, she threw a hell of a game. You know, kudos to her. But we couldn't have asked for anybody else other than Claire Oberdorf up in that clutch situation. Calissa and Cesaro for Iona and Calissa for us, they threw a great games, both of them. It was a pitcher's duel. Um, we knew we had to go out there. We weren't putting great swings on the ball early in the game. We had to make all our plays in the field and just a pitcher's duel. You never know what can happen. And we got down with two outs in the bottom of the seventh. And I was up there and I was just trying to put the ball in play and I was able to get one out. And then KK was able to get on and Morgan was able to get her in. And that was a good team win. It just goes to show that you're never uh, you're never out of it until the final out, and uh, you know there's that old saying, you know, and uh, hopefully we can uh, uh, use that as momentum for tomorrow and uh, get another win. Any time we get down, we got to get ready to bounce back. So they punched us, and we had to punch back at some point, and um, we just tried to keep playing our game, and we knew it would come. I was really proud of Haley Giantorno. She did a great job coming off the bench cold to uh, get that bunt down in a perfect spot to uh, get those runners in scoring position. This definitely gives us confidence. Staying in the winners bracket is always key. So we're just going to keep trying to play our games and just try to win two more games.